Hi, welcome back. So today I have something that I wanted to unbox, the Logitech MX Keys. Um, it's a really nice keyboard, especially if you use your, if you're on your computer a lot, or for instance, if you're a programmer or something. I think it's a really nice keyboard because I've, I just got it recently and previously I was using like the really standard ones like Zilona Nunwanga, like Thao or something. And they're really hard to use and they're really annoying. And if you have to use them every day, it's really hard. So that's why I decided to get myself like, you know, this really nice keyboard. So uh, that's like how the front looks like. Like it comes like with the MX keys and the Logitech, then the picture of the keyboard. Then at the back, they're like a bunch of instructions and the features and all that. So I'd already opened the box. So let me just take it out. Okay, so this is how it looks on the inside. It has like this MX sticker or something, then the Logitech badge. Then inside the box, is where you get the keyboard like has like a certain white wrapper then on the inside there are like a bunch of instructions like the features that the keyboard has it actually has a lot of features that's why i really liked it and that's why i would recommend it it has a, a whole bunch of features like for instance there's an easy switch where you can connect multiple devices to your keyboard then uh, a bunch of other instructions as well so Inside of the box, here's the keyboard itself. This is how it looks like. It has like a really soft feel to it. The keys, the key, the keys themselves have like a certain depression inside. So when your hands rest on them they feel a little more a little more comfortable just generally like typing on it is quite fun like you enjoy typing on it then it has like a whole bunch of features for instance um these three buttons here is where you choose which device you want to use because it's a wireless keyboard so you can connect it to your for instance uh, personally the first one is connected to my desktop that has uh it has a receiver. It has a receiver. It also comes with a box that you stick to your to your desktop or to your laptop. It has like the Logi, Logitech logo at the back. So it can help you differentiate it between other receivers that you have. So back to the keyboard. So uh on the second button, for instance, I decided to connect it to my laptop. In case I'll be using my laptop or something, then I just want to switch to my laptop automatically. It now does that through Bluetooth. Then on the third one, I just decided to like connect my phone. Though I won't really be using it that much, but yeah. So the thing I also love about the keyboard is that the function keys are customizable. You can decide to Put a whole lot of functions on your function keyboards they're all custom the keyboard the keyboard comes with the software that helps you modify whichever functions that you want for whichever purpose you'd want it to do for instance then it also just out of the box it comes with a bunch of features like for instance it has a button for opening your calculator i've never really needed a shortcut for that but for some reason it really feels comforting to just know that you can open a calculator by like clicking they have a different calculator but then you know then it, it also has a camera shortcut just out of the box then all these other keyboards then it has a charging port right here it uses a uh, type c charger which also comes with the package uh, these are, I, I'm not sure if all the, all the cables come in this color, but this is the cable that it comes with. 
so you sort of like just plug it in into the port and then it has the on and off button as well so uh, if it's off i think i've seen this in a lot of logitech products if it's off you can like see the red and you can put it on and then you see the green then it also has backlighting it's a backlit wireless keyboard i mean that's one of the reasons you really come to love it you know sometimes you just switch off the lights just so you can type on a wireless on a on a backlit keyboard it serves no purpose but it's just fun it's fun to do it it's from my experience it sort of just improves or increases your productivity because once you have it it's like you always want to just go back to your desk and get your work done then another feature i also noticed is that it has a certain feature whereby if you take your hands close to the keyboard the lights come on i don't know it's like they have proximity sensors throughout the keyboard because you just take it closer then it comes on so that's also a cool feature to have sort of just nice to have it you know just go to your keyboard then it comes on i don't know why it hasn't come on. oh yeah maybe there's a delay or maybe it hasn't connected to my computer right now but yeah that's how the keyboard looks like it has from the back it has like you know this tiny writing that you never really look at but it's sort of nice to have in your in your electronics then at the back it also has like the mx keys so it's a really solid keyboard and i don't know it feels really nice it feels really really nice so let me show you guys how the software also works okay now this is how like the logitech options software looks like you can download it from their website so right now i have like a logitech mouse and uh, these are logitech mx keys here so these are the function keys that i said are quite modifiable like for instance the brightness down button which is uh, under f1 right now can be modified into the my home button or to launch application or advanced click by calculator and like a whole bunch of functionalities that's why like that one that that's one of the reasons that makes the mx keys like really interesting because for instance even the calculator button can be customized to open a web page keystroke assignment i'm not sure what that means but and like all these other options are available then maybe like the sleep button at the end can now be modified to be the lock screen by default it comes on the lock screen i just set it to sleep or it can be used to sign out or to shut down or any other generic function that you would like to have so that's why the mx keys is really nice like apart from the customization the keystrokes themselves it's it's a really comfortable keyboard it's it's fun to use then the buttons for changing between devices basically this is how the keyboard looks like so if you're looking for a keyboard i would highly recommend it so i'm thinking that's it for today's episode so until next time so you can like and subscribe or even comment and we'll see you guys next time